guys welcome back it's time for some more launcher modes that is my chat laughing at me just like that when i said that i was going to do launcher modes because they know that i don't like launchers i am not a fan of rocket launchers so this i know the, i saw comments already pe people saying like this is going to be easy mode this is going to be like the easiest playthrough ever not if you don't like launchers bro uh yesterday we got ourselves the mechanic we found some pretty good class mods including a minesweeper and a rocketeer got ourselves a stopgap we got a matosis hex what the frick dude uh, otherwise we're just using some random launcher junk that we found along the way in terms of the the launchers we've gotten so far we had the ghetto burger and we had the porta pooper as well as the mechanic otherwise we have a lot more to go a lot more to chase i've actually made a list a checklist you would say and we've got a lot more to go so it's gonna be a fun playthrough we're gonna get every single named unique and legendary as we go and then we're going to start taking on the in-game content here's my skill tree so currently it's just the blueberry punch down to vampire nothing in pumpkin spice nothing in mountain dew but we do have points here from our class mod that does count in borderlands 3 and nothing in grape kool-aid also guardian rank is off and we have uh what do we have on the cartels event yeah we have on the cartels event that way we could potentially get us a yellow cake which would be really nice the next legendary rocket launcher that drops i have to throw it off of a cliff well that sucks and the reason for that is i accidentally stole chuck mangione's channel points the other day on stream i didn't mean to it was an accident and i owe him so it's going to be the next legendary off of a cliff the next legendary rocket launcher off of a cliff so i did make it extra punishing for myself you know for chuck i got no other reason oh yeah also i owe captain spalding as well <laughs> Whee! oh the skeet shoot i have a question if you're doing a shotgun playthrough are you allowed to use the boob sickle <laughs> what did he say it's yeah you know, it's debatable you know what i'm saying but no, I don't. I don't use it. All right, so what am I doing? I gotta go meet the uh, meat slab of the anvil. Oh, good news. That means we can go after Ruby's wrath. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And nailed it. <laughs> Austin powers the shit out of this car. No. How does this keep happening? Oh, there we go. Yep, yep, yep. Ah, got it. Sweet. Ooh, we'll be able to get the quadimizer next too. And then the Freeman. Oh, man, we're going to start getting some launchers today. That day one was a little rough around the edges. You know, you can't get a whole lot on day one. There's not a lot of early game launchers. But now that we're now that we're at Eden 6, we're going to start getting some stuff. Hmm. Uh-oh. 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 Uh, that was not very good damage. He's level 23. He's two levels above me. All my launchers are pretty terrible. Oh, no. It, oh, damn, dude. I was about to jump into Iron Bear. All I need is a miracle. All I need is more launcher ammo. Ooh. <gasps> no way. No, no way is right because that's a Garcia. Son of a bitch. The one time he drops a Garcia on the first run and I can't use it. Oh, oh, oh shit, I got you good, you <laughs> oh, Damn, dude. Hey, look. Oh shit. That's even better. Yoink. Alternating nukes. Oh. I told you guys, I told you, I took all the time to, to set up this uh, freaking thing and then we get it. I'm happy though. Uh, that's that's going to help big day. You sure about that? All right. Oh, but now I got to yeet it. I forgot I got to yeet it. No. <laughs> Thanks, chat. I'm glad you guys remembered. Ruby's wrath. Goodbye. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. Oh, oh, no, what are you doing? You tried to knock me off a cliff. Did you see that shit? Hope you're happy, Captain Spaulding. Cruel and inhuman punishment. That is, that's the story of my life on this game. 3,000 whoop who's later. Please, please, yes, thank you. Oh my God. I was beginning to think it didn't exist in the game anymore. <laughs> and luckily nobody redeemed through your next legendary off a cliff before that happened. So we're good. Look at that damage difference between like, they're both level 22, but a green Atlas launcher versus the Ruby's wrath. Good Lord. That was a nightmare. Damn. Damn. Okay. You know what? Maybe it was worth the farm boys. And it does only consume one ammo per shot. And it is absolutely nuking these nerds. So that's cool. I can live with that. All right, break. You kill all those guys. I'm going to go get my quadomizer. 
Bam. Kicked her ass off. All right, here's the problem. Oh, Jesus Christ, dude. Holy shit, Brick, don't do that. What the hell is wrong with that guy? Oh, please, please, please. Yes, we're done. Man, we're just drowning in the good stuff now, dudes. Can't use that until we level up, though. Wait, was that level 24? Mother... <laughs> we're not even level 23 yet, dude. Oh, well. There's more time with the Ruby's Wrath, huh? I might hang on to this. I might be able to rocket launch myself with this thing. Or, you know, like, rocket jump. Oh, damn. I mean, technically, rocket jump. <laughs> Shit. Oh, so stupid. So now we gotta do our mouse and keyboard. Okay, plenty of room over here. There we go. Oh my God, that makes me dizzy doing that. There we go. Oh yeah, baby, look at that. Woo! Did I miss? It shoots out seven rockets, how did I miss? Very particular set of skills. It's not that funny, Tina. Nice. Oh, I gotta reload. Don't go anywhere. First run, baby. Come on, first run. You know you want to. Huh? Huh? Oh. Yes! Thank God. First run of something. That's freaking miraculous. All right, in case... Jesus Christ, it's noon, guys. In case you've never shot the Freeman before, this is what this thing does. You can control where the rocket goes. Can be very useful. Somebody's hiding behind cover, you know? You just be like, uh, oh, they're behind this cage. Oh, they're behind that uh, barrier. It's a pretty interesting launcher for the... The hell was that? I bounced off the top rail and I bounced off the second rail. Actually, we'll respawn. I need to some more rocket ammo. Big brain plays, guys. It's day number two of the launcher, Moe's. Boom, and we need a new name. What you guys got for me? Mozuka. Mozuka's good. I really like Mozuka. Mozuka. All right, Mozuka it is. Let's go. Whee! Nope. Nope. Oh, oh shit. Nope. Okay, she moved. All right, I wasn't ready for that. All right, that works. <laughs> that was some damn fun shooting, he says. Bro, I feel like he was not watching me at all. All right, guys, real quick while we're in the middle of this video, question of the day. We'll do a little early for once. If you could take any, any skill from any character across any of the games into arms race, which skill would you take and why? Let me know in the comments down below. Best one gets pinned to the top. Oh, hold on. I got a whispering ice. Whispering ice is like the best grenade to use on this bridge. And here's why. Whee! <laughs> no, that's a lot of damage. Well, I didn't see too many people go flying off, but they did all die. So that's cool. Yeah. I, he's dead. He's <laughs> just jumping back and forth. What is he doing? <laughs> what is he doing? Never noticed him do that before. Bring out the Iron Bear and go nuke mode. Let's go nuke mode, guys. Damn, Balex, your head was in the way. Oh my god. Pick a spot, woman. Jeez. All right, what we got? 10 gallon. Basically a launcher. That's a lot. Oh, level up. Easiest level up of the day right there. Walk past the tree. <laughs> that was my best trick shot yet, dude. Uh oh. He outsmarted me with his jump skills. Oh, look at that. That was quick. All right, shoot me. There we go. See, you got a rocket. I need more rocket ammo. Keep shooting me, please. I don't think, uh, you know, honestly, I think we should probably go respec to like really focus on what our build is ultimately going to be because it's not going to be... I don't think we're really gonna do much with short fuse. So let's uh let's go respec. One wiener later. Give Iron Bear bonus damage too. Alright, that'll work for now. So far in this entire playthrough, we've only seen one Linoge and it was in a vending machine. Not to jinx myself or anything, but like what the hell? I shouldn't have said that. I should not have said that. Oh, that was bad. I was a little too close to her when I shot that. All right. What did we get? Ice Queen. Cool. All right. We're out. Yep. Almost done with Eden sucks. I mean, six. Yeah, definitely. E level up damage bonus. It's going to be good versus Graveward. So we're going to shoot him with. Uh, should we try the Quatomizer? Let's try the Quatomizer, dude. Okay. Great time for me to have to reload. <laughs> oh, 
Not the best option, all right. How about you do this thing, man? Do this thing. You did, dude. Bye. Okay, is this one? Skag dog days. Skagzilla, baby. Oh God. Damn. Jeez, dude. Calm down. Calm down, dude. Calm down. No, stop. Good lord. All right, let's get a tongue guska. First run, baby. Damn it, mince meat. Grab their meat? Bro just told me to grab their meat. Oh my, my, my. Oh, these guys didn't level up with me though. So I guess there's not really any point in farming them if they're not gonna level up with me. Fudge. All right, well, we'll have to come back to these guys when we hit mayhem then. All right, guys, that's where we're gonna wrap it up for the day. Guys, make sure you answer today's question of the day, which I asked earlier in the video. If you haven't already, drop that down in the comments below. Like I said, the best one gets pinned to the top of the comments. When we come back tomorrow, it's gonna be time to farm for the hot drop, one of the rarest items in Borderlands 3. We're gonna start the day off with that tomorrow, so wish me luck. All right, guys, I appreciate you all watching. I will see you guys in the next video. Y'all have a great day. Take care.